Hello, and welcome to Antlab Games. I'm your host, Anthony. And I'm Francis. Today we're playing Bamboo. Bamboo. Yes. yes, so we are growing some bamboo. Yes, we are being, kind of. we are growing bamboo. <laughs> well, we're kind of like chopping bamboo and using it to do all sorts of things to improve our house, mm -hmm. to grow our household, yes. uh, but maintain balance. Yes, we're trying to create just like a very zen, cool place for our family to right. exist in too many generations. Exactly. So take a look at the table in this Asian-inspired, I would call it Batoku light, because it, <laughs> yes. it is in the Batoku family. It in is. Fact, it is that, in the Kamushi. It's like the Kamushi, is it Kamushi? family. It's it is definitely, it. yeah. It's called the Kamushi Saga. Yes. So this is the second game in the Kamushi Saga. Yeah, so you have Batoku, you have this bamboo, and mm -hmm. then you have another game, Silk, which is forthcoming. This, this is forthcoming. But so this is number two. So this is... While it looks and, and, and kind of resembles Batoku, it's 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 a very it's different. Very different. Certainly yeah. very different. Mm -hmm. um, and we're going to take you through sort of the uh, you know obviously the, the little bit of the setup and then jump right into the gameplay. Yeah. Uh, so we are like we said uh, chopping bamboo, right? So if we take a mm -hmm. look at the board close up, we'll go through the different sections. So every yes. uh, we're going to be playing the game. Uh, there'll be four different seasons per round mm -hmm. and four rounds, right? right? So you should call them years, right? Because mm -hmm. sure. it starts with spring, summer. Yeah. Fall and then winter, and then we reset and do it and do it again. Uh, all the while, we're going to be um, taking bamboo actions, bringing our incense to the temples mm -hmm. to uh, take actions with our bamboo, and you'll see how that all works. But uh, for all intents and purposes, uh, the real important areas of the board they're going to look at is one, the temples that have these forest spirits, and that's the very Batokui mm -hmm. part of the game. Yes. Um, but then you also have like this balance area where we're going to be bringing. Uh, scoring objectives over to our households. Mm -hmm. We're going to have this um, household section, which is like making um, improvements to your home. Mm -hmm. And we'll be bringing in these different room improvements that come in four different categories. Yeah. Uh, we'll be buying food because you got to feed your family. Mm -hmm. uh, and we'll be, you know, uh, manipulating, guess, the yeah, bamboo. manipulating the bamboo yeah. track. So um, if we take a zoom out a little bit, you want to go over your player board real yeah, quick and absolutely. show people what that's all about? Perfect. So our player boards are our homes, right? Uh, so like Anthony said, we've got a couple of different things going on mechanically in this game. And most importantly, we have this sort of, t I'm going to say tile placement situation, sure. which is here in our house. So we're going to be taking these home improvements tiles and placing them on our boards. And we're going to be scoring balance tiles based on where we're placing them in our house. So the balance tiles that we'll bring out, and we both start with one, um, will tell us what we're going to score for if we can get that orientation of tiles mm -hmm. into our home. Exactly. Right. So that's what we're going to be trying to do during the game, is uh, is get these balance tiles in, get our house organized, and score them. Our our home improvement tiles are not going to move from the spaces where we place them, so we have to be very careful about where we want to put them. Uh, so that's what's going on here. We have our money, which of course is important. We have our incense sticks, which we start with three. We're going to get one more before the game starts that we can use to make offers at the temples. Um, and then we have our bamboo storage over here. And the bamboo colors are associated with temples that we can visit. So on our turn, we're going to be uh, placing our marker next to a, a set of bamboo stalks. Mm -hmm. And that's going to indicate what temple we're going to go to, which right. temple we're going to make offerings at, and ultimately what actions we're going to take. Because if you notice, there's these little icons on the bamboo, right. which is going to be our action selection part of the game. Correct. So if you're a little confused at how you know which temple to go to, if you look at the color of the, um, mm -hmm. the bamboo, so purple, for example, mm -hmm. and then you go to the board. And the shape of the temple, too. Right. Yeah. You go to the board. Well, you'll probably see the color more, yeah. unless, unless you can't see color, yeah. and you obviously want to look at the shapes. But you'll see there's a purple temple, blue temple. Green temple, red temple, right? Mm -hmm. But they are all different in case you have trouble dis distinguishing the, the colors. Um, so, yeah, so that's right. Mm -hmm. uh, this little section above our board that's like this little clamshell, this fan, mm -hmm. I guess it is, um, is for when we complete and score one of these uh, balance, balance tiles. tiles. You then just put it face down up here and we'll keep them there until the end of the game. So that's how you, that's, that's where you place them. Uh, down here we're going to store our food. Mm -hmm. uh, and again, we store our incense here like you, dis uh, you discussed earlier. Um, the house is set up in three different categories. It's mm -hmm. the left part, which is these six, the right part, which is these six, mm -hmm. and you'll see the symbols, right? So this is the right, it almost looks like a fast forward symbol yeah. on a CD player. <laughs> uh, the rewind symbol on a CD player <laughs> is these two. And then the center with the star is basically the entire house. So that's, yeah. so when you do get these uh, balanced tokens, you're gonna have them for either the star, which will be the whole house, or the left, which will only apply to that, 
uh, or the right, which will only apply to that. And as you score them, that's how you get rid of these tiles. Yeah. Now, why this is important, if you could zoom in on my board again, mm -hmm. I'll explain this quickly so it'll help you. Um, as we bring these improvement tiles out, you'll notice that these tiles have a little number at the bottom. These are comfort points. Mm -hmm. So what we're trying to do, in addition to scoring these patterns, is we're trying to get um, points evenly distributed throughout our house, the comfort points. Those mm -hmm. are not victory points. And at the end of the game, if we have an imbalance, that's going to cost us um, right. our happiness points. So we don't want to do that. An so imbalance we'll, between the two the sides values. of your home, yep. right? Exactly. So if you add them all up on your left and you compare it to the, the sum of the room tiles on your right, yep. any difference times points. two <laughs> is what you're going to lose in points. Happiness points. That's the victory points in this game. And that's the track right here. We start yep. at five. Mm -hmm. So that'll be our track. Um, that's our round tracker up there. Uh, and that's it. So at the beginning of the game, as you said, we, we've set it up. Uh, for two players, uh, we're, we're bringing in sort of this third player to just throw out their incense. And it's going to yep. force us, because this is an area control board, the temple. And whoever has the most uh, incense burn there, whoever prays to that god more, will get uh, to take this spirit into their tableau. Mm -hmm. And you can use those as a once per round uh, bonus to let yes. you take additional actions. That's, that's what they do. So um, the way you seed these uh, these incense uh, tokens out, there's eight of them in total, and these little tiles will tell you, and you just put them out randomly, and they tell you how many go in each. So it's always three, three, two, and zero. Yep. So, so you'll see us do that every round. Every round, anyway. right? So at the beginning of the game, and that's it for for two player, and also you also have to uh, discard certain tiles from the uh, the house tiles that are for the the anything above two players. Right. So and they all they're all marked. The book tells you how to do all that. It especially has rules for the two player games. Um, but with that, the first uh, season mm -hmm. is spring, yep. and what we're checking here is we're actually going into the, um, he stays there for now, because oh, we have to sorry. do the first one. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to take one tile per player for here. These are gifts. So we're going to take gifts and we're going to take incense. So we're taking gifts, and the two offered gifts right now are the two actions. So there's four actions that you're going to get. Uh, it's going to be the money action, mm -hmm. it's going to be the food action, it's going to be the decorate, mm -hmm. and it's going to be the balance. Those yeah. are the four main actions. Like, that's it. Um, so we get to, in player order, she's player one, she gets to choose whichever one she wants. She wants two coins or she wants to take food? Ooh. Um, I will take the food. Okay, so then you just okay. take so a food I will token. Take, like, I'll take the two food. So um, I obviously am stuck with the other one, so that is to taking two coins, which isn't terrible. And we'll mix those up and draw two more every round. Uh, we also get one incense each from that offer. We're mm -hmm. going to get that every round. So that's the whole bit for the first for the season, right? Yep. So now we go on to summer, mm -hmm. which is take actions. So now, and taking actions is really burning some incense yeah. at the temples. Right. Um, take your two coins so you don't forget. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's important. All right, so let's see. What do I want to do? Um, I don't know. What do you want yeah, to do? I know. Well, so I'll, I'll kind of talk you through strategically what I'm thinking, right? Mm -hmm. So, again, this area of the board is kind of area control, and we know that we already have the, like, artificial player has taken up a lot of space down here. I also need to look at what I've got in Bamboo because for the turn that I'm taking, uh, I'm going to pick which section I want to go to, but I'm limited to the number of incense sticks that I'm placing out at that temple, mm -hmm. I'm limited to how many stalks of bamboo I have in that section, in that color for mm -hmm. that temple. So like if I were to go here, I could only spend two incense sticks, but if I went here to purple, I could only spend one incense mm -hmm. stick. So that's what I'm kind of thinking and about. And you have to spend go. as many incense if you have them. So if there are three bamboos mm -hmm. in that supply, you do have to put out three bamboo sticks. Exactly. So I'm going to I'm going to go ahead and go here to blue, to my blue temple, and I have two bamboo stalks here. So I'm going to pay two. Well, not really pay, but I'm going to put two incense up there on two right. on blue. Yeah. Uh, if there are any incense on the location when you put your incense there, they go above mm -hmm. the incense, and that's that's important, important. because what's going to happen is at the end when we do our area control. Um, whoever, like if there's an equal number, mm -hmm. whoever's on top and place that's the last, tie breaker. that's the one's going to be the tiebreaker. So, okay, so now I take all of my blue bamboo, mm -hmm. all two of them, and I'm going to place them down here in the reeds, and this is like a really cool mechanic. So, um, so I need to think about where I want to put these because I'm going to be taking these two actions because I have two bamboo, I place two sticks, so I get to pick two actions, right? Um, and this is the food, get food action, and this is the... Um, decorate. Decorate action. Mm 
Uh, but it's also critical to figure out where it's I want to put your these, home. right? I call it decorate, but it's, yeah, it's home improvements. <laughs> yes, let's call it what it is. Um, so I'll go here, and I'll go here, I guess. Let's do that, right? Mm -hmm. um, so I'll go ahead and take my actions first. So I get to take the food, which I'll take like one of these. Mm -hmm. And then I get to take an improve your home action, and I'll look at this and go, okay, I kind of need like those little lantern so I'll probably grab this one um, now I have to pay for this so I'm gonna pay three coins because I grabbed it from the top but I also immediately get three points three happiness points three yeah. happiness points. Yeah, you're gonna pay for I'm this just like <laughs> happiness is not always free people no it's definitely uh, not. <laughs> and I can put that anywhere I want on my board mm -hmm. uh, but I'm gonna go once ahead you and place it, it here once you're, you place it, it's you're done doom. so I'll put that there um, these have been paid I pay that to the bank uh, so um, nice. Now I'm going to get new stocks, right? So mm -hmm. I'm going to push these up like this. So this is actually going to grow this bamboo stock like that. And this is going to grow this bamboo stock. And then these two at the top are the ones I get to now take. And I put them back in my board in the area where they, where they belong. belong. Now, if you there's a couple of rules with this. Mm -hmm. You're There's a, a, a maximum of two per stock that right. you can place. So if you have like three, say mm -hmm. next time she has three, you can't put all three in one stock. You can only put two. Yeah. Um, if you ever, when you pull the bamboo back to your player board, say she pulls back two greens next mm -hmm. time, she has to put one here and the, th and the extra one can go in any other color. Right. It's and your it's choice. Like, it's used as that color. As that color. It becomes that color. Right. At least for, yeah, for you. And in case you're that. curious <laughs> about this, we didn't explain it. The symbols at the bottom uh -huh. oh, are yeah. purely for setup. So the ones that are blank, they're, are, they're just blank. The ones that have diamonds are all the ones that started in the starter stock, mm -hmm. randomly placed. The ones that have these um, vase tiles are the ones that start, are the starting player ones. Like you mm -hmm. get one of each color, right. right? So that's that's all that means, so in case you're curious. Um, because I know you're watching a video, you're probably thinking, well, what does that mean? Is that for something Because that's what else? we did when we learned how yeah, to Yeah, I'm like, so. why are there symbols here? But that's it. Yeah. So she took her action. Now, look, we're going to keep going uh -huh. until you don't have any more incense and yeah. you have to pass. I actually do fill this up as well. Uh, no, you don't. So, oops, not with that. Not from there. From so yeah. we have a... You've got those and I've yeah. got these. So right? these would okay. slide down if we mm -hmm. take from below and get cheaper, like any other track would. And then you fill from the top. Uh, the same goes with these, I believe. Yes. They all, everything just slides down. Yep. All right, so now I do the same thing. I got to pick a a row that I want to go after. So I'm thinking maybe I'll go after so like green and red. Of course, green and red are both like yeah, I know. But I think I'll I'll use that for demonstration purposes. I'll take this one. Uh, so I'm gonna go green, right? So I've got these two green ones. Um, I'm gonna have to do two incense like we showed. So I'll put two incense on green. Again, they go on top. I'm still not winning because the the AI player has three there, so I, I don't have it. Um, so I'm gonna put these in over here, but I'm gonna get the action. So I'm gonna get the two coins and the food. So that's my, those are the two actions. So you haven't seen okay. any exciting actions yet. Yeah. <laughs> um, but uh, you always need, you have to feed your people at the end. Yes. So uh, in the winter, so you wanna make sure you have enough. So what you wanna do here is think about what you wanna get. Mm-hmm off the top. Right. <laughs> that's that's the trick, right? So and these stars we didn't talk about are wild. Are wild. Yes. So these go up. I'm gonna pull this purple and this blue. They're gonna go on my player board right here. So I took the balance action mm -hmm. and now I have the star which is wild. It can be any action. Yeah. So that's yes. my whole turn. And, and the reason you're putting this little piece down on one of these is because you can't take the same color mm -hmm. again. Because if I grab, you know, like two or three greens, right, yeah. you're like, oh, I want to do green again. Mm -hmm. You can't. Um, At least not this turn. Yeah. You, uh. You, uh. You have so much money. I do. You're like loaded. You, uh. <laughs> you, uh. <laughs> oh, what man. What are these, three? I think that's a three. Is that mm -hmm. a Roman numeral three? Yes. These represent sure. three? I'll take some. All right. So as long as we're in agreement that these stand I for agree. three. I agree. I agree. Then I don't have to carry all these little ones. I'll trade six. Oh, this is kind of for two of these. There funky. you go. Um. Ah, interesting. Oh, it's only one bamboo. I'm so limited now because, like, I can't, I can't get any of those. Like, I can't get the purple because I can't put two incense sticks out. You know. 
Mm-hmm. And even if I were to get another red bamboo, mm-hmm. I only have I'll only have one more incense stick left to put over in any of right. these things. So I'm a little bit out of luck and out of time. <laughs> um, okay, so I think what I'll do is this. I'm gonna go here mm-hmm. and I'm gonna spend one stick at the purple place. There. Mm-hmm. And I'm gonna put my one, this is a balance action, so I get to take another one of these tiles. And I think I'll take this one, because it kind of lines up with what I'm going for anyway. Mm-hmm. So I put that here on my board, and that's like a thing I'm working on, my little assignment. Um, and then this little, this nice little tray, just you feed it right in. Yep. Like that. There we go. Now instead of taking that tile, mm-hmm. you could take that action and just get a point. Right. Right. And oh, with this one you could just and get actually, a I also get to take another one. So the way that this balance works is you can do one of two things, and we haven't had to do the second thing yet, mm-hmm. which is to score these balance uh, uh, tokens. Mm-hmm. Um, but you can actually take. You get. You get to do two things. You can take one of these tiles, or you can score a tile, or you could take two tiles, or score two tiles, or you could take a tile and score a tile. You get to do two things. Mm -hmm. So I am going to do that now. I just have to figure out which one I want. (laughs) So you can do two. You can, because, let's just to be clear, right? Mm -hmm. The balance action, you get to do two things. Um, You get to take two tiles, Mm -hmm. because you can do either, you can take a tile, or you can score a tile. Yep. And you can do two of any combination of those two things. Right. Right now, we're not in a position to score tiles, so yeah, looks like we're just taking tiles. But you do have a limit of how many of these you can have. Yes, exactly. And if exactly. you can't take a tile, you can just take a victory point. Right. Which is right there. Mm-hmm. So, so that's the that's the trade-off. I'll just take this one then. But you can't. The thing is, you can't. You get one victory point for the whole thing, or yeah. you take two tiles. Right. Now you don't get to take. One victor exactly. point and a tile, just yeah. to be very clear there. Okay, cool. It's a big or statement. <laughs> That's it. So then I get to put this away, and I will put it here. Yeah. Boop. There we go. Your turn. Okay. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to take the... I'll take the red action, right? So I'm going to need two sticks out here, which is kind of silly, but whatever. So I'm going to put one stick here. Now, this is something you can do. Mm-hmm. I can pay a coin yeah. to put a incense in any other temple. Right. Just paying. I'm like bribing. <laughs> bribing the monks. I'm like, dude, here it is. Yeah. Um, like, take this up for me. Yep. So now I've got, if you notice, mm. I've got tied, but because I'm on top, yeah. I'm winning against this fool. All right, so my two. Let's wait, yeah. Well, no, that's it. Well, I know. (laughs) So, uh, yeah, I'm looking at her. She can't make it. (laughs) She has no competition here. Um, So, basically, my two actions are, one, I'm going to get two more coins. I'm just ridiculous rich in this game. I know. It's insane how much money you have. And the uh, improve the house. So, I'm going to buy things. I have so much money, I might as well buy from the top. And, again, these are... are, each of them has a specific symbol on them, right? So you've got to see, like, you've got the garden ones, you've got the religious ones, which are like the temple. You've mm-hmm, got this one is like ones, items and mm-hmm. or tools, I think it is. Yep. And then there's one more. Um, nature. Nature, I think. Yeah, nature, nurture. So I'm going to take this guy. He's worth, he's cost me three bucks. He's going to give me three victory points. Um, he can go anywhere. But if you notice on my board, I kind of want to get him on the left side because it's saying left, s- bottom, and then right. According to this, or it's got to be like this: boom, 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 boom. These four, mm-hmm. right? So um, that's worth eight points if I could pull that off. So, that's great. Um, but yeah, so that's what I want to do there. I do get three points for that, and we will pull another tile, and that's it. So I'll push these guys back in. I'll throw one here, and I'll throw one here. Boom. Nice. I don't really love the uh, what's being offered here, but <laughs> it is what it is. All right, your go. Ah, right, and you're out of bamboo. 
I sure am. So I don't have to worry about you going anywhere else. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I will. Um, I think I'll go here, actually. And I'll just put, oh, I wish I had a dollar, but I don't. Oh, man. I borrowed a dollar. <laughs> if I had a dollar, I could put this here. But right. I can't. So and that would have gained good. you another, yeah. Whatever. So oh, I'll just really leave here. Broke. I am so broke. Um, just this improvement <laughs> cost mm -hmm. me so much money. Um, I also haven't taken any money action, so that's fine. So now I only placed one incense, but I'm going to place all three of my right. green. But bamboo. you can only take one. I can only of those take one of those actions. actions. That's okay. I'm going to take an action to get two dollars. Ah, so you're going to take yes. the money action. That's smart. Yep. There you go. And I'm going to put that like here and I'll put this like there and I'll put this like there. I get this, this, this. Okay. Okay. So then gets back to me. I pass. Right. Because I've done no to. incense. Mm -hmm. No choice. No sense uh, goes all. back to you. You have to pass because mm -hmm. you have no incense. And then we move on to the um the next phase, right? Yep. So we go to autumn. Yes. So let's go to Autumn. So we invoke the spirits mm -hmm. and we see who <laughs> wins. So he's going to win this. This gets discarded. Yep. You win Tengu and you place them out there. Okay. Um, I win Kitsune because I have tied, but I'm above mm -hmm. both board. Uh, and he wins that guy. Awesome. Yeah, right. I'm going to check what my guy does too. All right. So that is, oh, I know what your guy does. He like, your guys, can resave a food, He can right? pay, no, he actually, pay he pays four food for you when you activate him in the winter. So you basically That's, never have yeah, to like buy he, food. Yeah, like he goes out and finds, finds food for me. Yeah, right? he feeds your people basically yeah, and you activate good. him once per winter. Yep. Um, so that is the, that phase. And now we move on to the winter. Mm-hmm. Where we are a feeding, right? So we also have to clear off. Oh no, he's all of not these. the he's not the feed your food guy. Oh, which one is he? No, that's the that's Ukami. He Oh that's ten good. If you yeah. wish you can discard all the food counters and refill the five spaces with new ones and no. you get one of the available counters. Because what happens is this you saw we didn't refill this right. offer. It only gets refilled in the winter after or we feed people. So. If you empty it yeah. during or the game. Exactly. Five new ones come out. So. Yeah, interesting. All okay. right, so he just lets cool. you reset that? Yeah, I haven't had him. No, oh, that's all right. Um, yeah, I don't even know what my Kitsune does, actually. Um, <clears throat> Kitsune, where are they? Did you look them up? In the back, in the back. Okay, Kitsune does, during the spring, all of the bamboo shoots that you activate during this turn are considered wild. That's actually That's cool. really yeah. good. Okay. Um, so let's go on to, that was Invoke the Spirits, yep, Recover Incense. Yep. So we're going to relocate the... Ghost player. It's called the yes. ghost player, actually. So uh, bring our incense back. And then, like I said, we've got these tiles here that we're just mm -hmm. going to randomly shuffle and then bring them out onto the board and see what gets what. So we're going to put three there, three there, which is already there, mm -hmm. two there, and none here. So okay. we'll put two here, and one, one up here. there. And that's all these tiles are used for. So that oh, is done. Great. The ghost player is set. Uh, the next spirit of the forest moves forward, which already automatically happens. So now we're in the winter. Wake up the spirits of the forest. That's optional. If we use these during the game, they get exhausted. Mm -hmm. um, now in the winter, they get they wake back up. Uh, feed your family. So you get to feed one food per tile in mm -hmm. your house. Yep. I've got one. This is worth three, but it's wasted. Yeah, and I've so. got one. I have a two tile, but that's the other ones in these. So. Wasted. All right. Update the tile markets mm -hmm. and then fill the empty food spaces. Okay. So we'll go and do all that. All right. So these get burned, all the and ones these. with the fire. And I'll bring out, they all slide down. And then we'll bring it out new tiles. Okay. And we'll bring out new food. One, only in the empty spots. Yep. Two and three. Okay. Okay. Uh, player uh, one changes. marker changes, so I am now player one. Mm -hmm. And then we go to the next piece. So we start over at the beginning. We bring out two random tiles. <laughs> gifts. So this is the gifts. The gifts from the forest. Mm -hmm. So here we go. There is going to be a decorate action. Oh, and a balance. And a balance action. Mm -hmm. I will take 
the decorate action. Okay. And you can have the balance. Great. So I will do my decorate. And then we also get these mm -hmm. incense. Yep. So the decorate is I can buy one of these. I'll spend three more bucks because I have it. <laughs> uh, I'll buy this guy, the temple. Or maybe I'll buy this picture. Yeah. Put that here. That's going to be worth three points for $3. I'm going to take this one and this one. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, I guess I'll take this one. That's seven comfort points. Mm. Yikes. Yeah, right. so you need to have seven comfort points worth of plants in your house. Is that what that's yep. saying? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot of plants. That's a lot of plants. Well, I already have four right there. Yeah, that's not bad. Well, no. no that's oh, no, that needs to be four. Yeah. Yeah, you need to have plants, four <laughs> plants. We'll see how this goes. Ooh, look at that. With that color. Yeah. Oh, plus anything else next to it. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Four, a four comfort point plant. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, so. Um, Okay, so that's that. Now yep. we move on to our action. So, Jit, now we continue like we did before. Yes, it's your turn. Yep. All right, just getting a feel for what's on the board and what I want to do. So I'm going to go to the blue, or what, do I want to go up here to the star? No, I'll go down here. I'll stay here. So I'm going to do blue. So I have two bamboo. I'm going to need to put two of these in blue, um, which is right here. It's not bad. And I've got a food action, which I'll just take some food. And I've got a balance action. So I will take this one, put that here. All these come down. You want to put another one up there mm -hmm. from the right? And then I will get ready to rumble. So we'll put that there, and we'll put this here. my turn. Okay. Hmm. All right, I guess I'll go. I guess I'll go here. Want to do that? Put this down here because it's in the way. Um, can't see it. No, there. okay, I'll put it over here. Right. Well, you could put it up here. Uh, yeah, I guess I could. Like up there. It's just in the way of my marker. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I'm thinking about. I've got all these reds, but like I don't really want to ever take control of that. <laughs> yeah, because you have it. Because I have it already. Um, blue is another food one. I'd like it's green, but I have absolutely no greens right now. Um, well, maybe I'll go purple, and I'm just going to do one. Hmm. And... I'm going to go here. I'm gonna take this and two dollars, please. Okay. Thank you. Is that it? That's all I can do. Would you play one bamboo? I play one bamboo. Wow, that's a short <laughs> turn. Uh, I'm going to go big. I'm going to just finish my round right here. So I'm going to activate Kitsune. So I'm going to, it's spring, mm -hmm. I'm going to make all of these stars, mm -hmm. all three of them. So three in purple. Where's purple? Up here? Mm -hmm. So I'll put three up here. And I will activate all three of these guys. They're all stars, so I'm just going to take three, action, three actions of what I want. So mm -hmm. first one, I'll take one of these. Um, hmm, I could do that. I'll 
do this one. Okay. And I'll put it, where is it, on here? That's the right one. Well, I can take two. I always forget that I could take two. Mm -hmm. That really bothers me. Because <laughs> I only took one last time. Uh huh. And I should have taken two. Now that really bothers me. Well, take another one. Right? Like You can. You can. I'll allow I it. I should have. Should I not have? Because I had one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. Make it right. You better make it right. You make it right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh. I don't really like <laughs> what it's saying here, though. Uh, maybe I'll do this one. I'm just going for easy ones, man. Oh, okay. That's one way to do it. Yeah, so that was my one action. My other action is going to be I'm going to take one of these things, and I will take, I guess I'll take another plant. Don't you be taking all my plants. Well, they're good. But I need them. Yeah, maybe I'll take another plant. <laughs> It's going to cost me a dollar, but give me a victory point. Okay. Push me up one. And I want to put that plant right there. And my last action, I'm going to take $2. You can fill that one in. Because these are all stars, mm -hmm. technically. And then I'll push these three in. So what do we want? I want to go here. I want here. I want here. And I want one, two, three. I'm not going to have enough food feed my people that's unfortunate so yeah so when we feed we have to feed for each of those yeah, decorations so I'm gonna put yeah. my two bucks back and I'll take a food instead with that action okay um, I'll just since they're all wild card anyway they're all you. wild card yeah. so I'll just switch my actions up and I'll just push these guys out what Ouch. <laughs> okay there you go Fix what that is green happening one. I don't know they popped okay Okay, that's my action. That's my action. Your go. Okay. Um, great. So I will go here mm -hmm. and spend three to go here. Mm. Boop. To the blue guy. And three actions here. Yeah? Mm-hmm. I will do balance action. Um, is that's actually oh, not a balance action. An home improvement. Yeah, home improvements. Home improvements. Yeah. Remember home improvement? I do. With JTT. I certainly do. Um, probably do one of those guys. I placed I placed three incense, right? You did. Okay, I'll go there, and I'll go there. Just make sure I have one. Okay, so I'll do my improvement first. So I'll pay a dollar. I'm going to take this. And I'm going to put it right there. And I'm going to use my wild to do another home improvement. Mm -hmm. I'm going to take this thing, this tool. Looks like a flip flop, but mm -hmm. it's a tool right there. And. Um, and then I get to do a food. Mm -hmm. So I'll just take a two. Push them up. Um, actually, I'll take a one. Okay. I don't waste my food. Um, all right. Yeah. Okay. Um, yes. That's What's it. Up? No, no, I pass. Not. You passed. Yeah. I still have one left. Oh, I know. So. I'm saying that's it for me. Yep. So I get to go. Put one out there. Well, what color did you red. pick? Oh, red down here. Okay. Yeah. Setting up with another Tengu anyway. Yeah. <laughs> um, and I place all three of these out. And I can take one action. Take one of them. Might as well take the star and just do whatever you want. I guess so, right? Yeah. Makes more sense. Um, we'll put that. Uh, I'm not really, like, interested in food right now. Whatever. I like these money ones. Get money. I'll do that for blue. Um, okay. So I'll do a star and I will just take two more dollars. Okay. Because I need the money. Yeah, money's tight in this game. It is tight. If yeah. you want to buy the big decorations. Yes. Which you need to 
That's you need good, good decorations. It's good for the points. OK. There. I'm done. OK. So that ends it. We push up to the next round, mm -hmm. uh, next phase, which is invoke yep. the spirit. So, yes. So um, what do we got? I've got you took that. this. So Again, because another. your three are on top yep. of his three. So I grabbed another Kitsune. You actually took the yeah. Ukami. Now that's the one that feeds your people. That. Yes, it is. And then you also get the Tengu. Yeah. So here's all of your stuff back. So we take all of our incense back. Mm -hmm. Here's yours. You grabbed mine. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, and then we'll reset his stuff real mm -hmm. quick. All right, one, two, three, and four. All right, so it's three there, three there, and two down here. Okay. I'll burn these. So that yep, we're... burn the bottoms. And then we'll reset those. Okay, these all come down. You go mm -hmm. slide all yours down. Yep. Don't bring any ones. Bring in the food as well. Okay. Three food tokens. One, two, and three. Okay. Good. Winter. Winter. All right. Did you up. use your people? Uh, yeah, I gotta reset him. I have two of the same guy now. Which and is I have great. three to feed, and so do you. Yeah. I think so. you're allowed to have two of the same spirit. That's it. I think that's the limit. Mm. Um, hmm. I'll pay my three food. Yeah, I'll pay mine too. I was going to use my guy, but then I'm like, oh, I don't really want him tapped in case I need him next time. Yeah, you can always use him I'm later exhausted. if you have more yeah. in the deal. So we fill the markets. Okay. We pass the uh, player mm -hmm. token over. We go back to the beginning, mm -hmm. and we do again. Two more rounds left. Yeah, yeah that's it. It's a very fast moving game. It is. Well, and you, the thing is, like, you're getting more. Potentially, you get more turns. Right, but it's still. But you end up using more yeah. of your sticks. So. Right. What do you want? The food or the decoration? Um, uh, the uh, balance, rather. Right? Balance. I'll take the balance. All right. Action. We'll gladly take the food. So I actually can score this balance token because I have a tool next yeah. to a lantern so that's going to be three points right, and it frees three. up a spot and it frees up a spot so I can take another one if you I can. want as my second action um, I guess I could take this one There we go. All right. Good. Uh, yeah, so you start us off. All right. All right. So I need to I need to figure out what I'm doing here. Um, hmm. <laughs> yeah. See, I want to do the balance, but I don't have any balance action, so that's not great. Well, you do have balance. You don't have any uh, improvement. Improve. Yes, yes, yes. I, I want to do the improvements action, and I don't have that. That ability, but I will. Mm. I'll just go here, and I'll spend one, one offering at this mm -hmm. temple, and I'll use this, and I'll go there, and I'll just take two dollars for now. Mm. Two dollars, please. Thank you. Okay. Uh, I guess what I'll do is I'll go to blue, and I'll put one on blue, and I will do a decorate action. I'll spend one coin and take this tool, I'll put it down here. These are going to slide. I get a victory point, if you will mm -hmm. be so kind, and then I will push Okay. I love this little growing bamboo yeah, thing. It's pretty cool. <laughs> it's so funny. All right, I'm going to go here. So I'll do three to the purple. 
and I get all three of these. Whoops. Come on, you. You little bugger. Um, I guess I'd go, I'll go here. Maybe go here again, and then like, I don't know, there. So I'll take my food first. if I want to take that one, but we'll see. I'll take my food. I'll take $2. Mm -hmm. And then I get to do anything. And I will do this because I need that tree. So I'll spend two. Get two points. Mm -hmm. And take this tree. All right. Ooh. And then slide. Very good, very good. Slide, slide. So you took two. Out I of took that one. two out of this yep. one, yeah. That was a big turn. Yeah. Three uh, incense, huh? Yep. All right, you're good? Yep. All right, I'm going to go green. So three on green. Mm hmm. So my three actions. So I have a wild, some money. So I'll start with the money. I'll grab $2. I will go and do. A decoration, so I'll pay one dollar and take this guy, place him here, and then these are going to come down, and then a star. A mm. star, I will do a decorate, okay? Uh, not decorate, balance. Balance, okay. I call it decorate. <laughs> so let's look at my board. Uh, so I can do two, I can take two of these, or I could score two of these. I'm going to score two of them, actually. Mm -hmm. First off, I'm going to score this one, which is that, 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 and that. Oh, nice. Just to hold it up for all players to see. <laughs> I can see. <laughs> but all player can see right now. Yes. So that's going to be eight points. And then okay. my second one will be to score this guy, okay. which if you notice, I've got to the right of my lantern is my plant. Oh, yeah. So I scored them both. That's a total of 11 points. Okay. So let's see. We've got one. Um, that's 14, so 24. So that goes there. Very good. And I'll put these back where they belong. Okay. And I'll put one here, one here, and one here. So I'll push this up once and that up twice. There we go. Okay. And it is your go. My go, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to go here. Yeah, I guess I'll go there. These aren't the actions I want to take, but what are you going to do? Mm. Um, so I will. I'm actually going to pay. I don't. I don't. Have we done this yet? Where we pay to go to a different temple? I did. We did. You did, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So I'm going to pay. One coin per that, that doesn't match. One. Hmm. Right now you're playing blue. Yeah, I don't know if it's worth doing. That. I'm like, are you going to mm. go for another Kitsune? <laughs> I don't know. I know. You know what I mean? I, I, yeah, for some reason I've, I thought I read you can only have two, but I can't find it right now, so don't quote me on that. But Because I already have two Kitsunis. But you get points for every unique yeah, spirit exactly. at the end of the game. So for me, grabbing another Kitsune is kind of like... Lame. Real lame. Yeah. That's a lame duck move. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to think of how many coins I want to spend. So I'll just spend, I'll just spend one. Mm -hmm. um, so here's one. I'm going to go here. And then I'm going to go up here. Because even if I place those two and you decided to go on red anyway, mm -hmm. you'd still make it. So. Yeah, I don't want to leave you on red. So. Yeah, <laughs> don't leave me on red. Um, and then I get to do all these things. So I'm going to do, and I did two actions. You did. So I could, I could take another balance. I can't score anything yet. You could take all the foods. Or I could just take all the food. 
um, which I'm gonna need four foods. So I need at least. I mean, I'm taking at least one food, so I'll take at least one mm -hmm. for one action. I'll go there, and then I will take the balance. What is there anything I want? I guess I'll. T I guess I'll do balance. That's fine. I can do that. I'll go there actually. I'll go there. And I'll take like Ooh, but that has to be over here. That's where it gets tricky. Mm. You know? Yeah. What does that one mean? This one? Yeah. So you have to have a lantern. Mm -hmm. You have to have one of these lantern symbols. Um, and then below it, you can have anything, but the two tiles have to add up to four comfort points. At least points. four, okay. Yeah, at least. So I'll take this one, um, I guess. Why not? Mm. I've got stuff. I just need to get a lantern at some point. So um, that's it. And then I grabbed my food, right? Mm-hmm. So boop, boop. Hmm. Okay. okay, all done. And that's great. you've got your turn left. Yep, <laughs> that's, great. that's great. That actually is really good. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Okay. So, <laughs> so, right. so I'm just going to take all these reds and put them Yeah, here. no, I don't want those <laughs> at all. So I'm just going to go here in blue okay. because why not? Mm -hmm. So I've got my two blue actions here. I'm going to take the star is going to be money, so I'll take $2. And the decorate will be a decorate action, which I will take. Um, well, improvement action, which is just a room. And I need I need a temple. So that there's a, the only temple, the cheapest temple, is in the number two slot. So I'll pay $2, and I'll take this guy. And I will place him right there. Mm -hmm. And I get two points. Okay. Doom, doom. Nice. Yeah, you got it. Okay, and I'll put that there. And I can push these guys in there, so I'll take, uh, I'll do this guy, and I'll do one of these. There. Good. Yeah, man, my board is just weird. You've got, like, so many, oh, yeah, just three. Okay. Yeah, it's very strange. All right, so that's it. We're actually here, but now here. Yeah. <laughs> so now we do, we count up, right? Mm -hmm. So you're going to win Ruinabi. Mm-hmm. I'm going to win... Who's this? Ba Kaneko. Mm -hmm. I have to look at what I don't know what even that, that guy does. This one goes to up. me as well. Rurakuri. Uh, mm -hmm. No, Kappa. 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 And then I Kitsune, get Kitsune goes to you. Yeah. How exciting. Well, we really won a lot that time. We did. We scooped them up. Because we're getting tons of incense is what it is. There's all yours. Yeah, Ba, uh, ba Kenko is cool. So... Um, when you do your offerings, mm -hmm. you can choose to place the incense in your temple or other temples without paying the coins. I like that one. So that's a good one, so especially if it's last round. Yeah, Oops. so a, a couple of ways to, to determine uh, what round you're in. You're like, okay, so you'll know, one, you have all the incense is about to be gone. Yep. And two, once these spirit tiles are gone, mm -hmm. that's it. So you start yep. with four, one per round. Exactly. The game, like, literally won't let you keep playing. Yes, yeah, so you <laughs> need to stop to. playing now and start scoring. Yeah. So we have three, two, zero. I'm going to wipe these. As yeah, you're doing that. Do whatever you need to do. <laughs> you know. You know. All right, so we've got our new ghost player layout. We'll go ahead and um, yeah, so wipe those. You wipe these. Mm -hmm. Put those away. They give you a nice little tray to hold they this do. stuff in, two, by the two way. nice little trays to hold yeah, those. Which we'll talk about later. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, can you slide all those... Decorations oh, yeah. now, please. Yeah, yeah. And we've got one and two. Boom. All right, so that was that. Now we're in a winter. We need to feed our people. Mm -hmm. I've got four. Uh, four. One, oh, two, no. three, four, five, six. I only have three food. I was oh, supposed to take. No. I was supposed to take food instead of money, but oh, crap. no biggie. I lose three points, so you can take three points from me. Okay. You just pay in points. It's like whatevs. Yeah. Oops, not plus 50. No, I'll take that. <laughs> you could do that too. All right, yeah. so that was, that's that's it for the winter, right? Yep. Starting player switches. Did yep. you switch there that you over to me? Um, what else we got? We got our sticks. 
Ah, yeah. So we're going to start at the beginning now so we get our sticks. We're going to get two of these. I get to pick first. Mm -hmm. Well, we didn't bring the food out. Oh, yeah. One, two, three. There you go. Mmm. Okay, mm -hmm. so here we go. Money or, ooh, nice. decorations. Mm. You love to call that balance. I know, no, sorry, yeah, it's, <laughs> it is decorations. I get them confused all the time. Yes, yes, Like it, I know what they are, but then my, the words don't come out. Okay, I'm gonna take this really? a dollar and okay. grab this guy. Let me take my plants. I like the plants, take man. plants, man. Um, I'll put it. I'm surprised you didn't take money. Here. Um, well, that's you needed it. Either way, I can always get more. I'll take two dollars, please. Yep. Thank you. I can take a big money turn next round. Well, there is no next round. Well, I mean, as we play. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, boom. Okay. I'm first. You are. So exciting. <laughs> I don't know what to do, though. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do purple. Okay. Because I can. Mm hmm. Um. Where's the purple guy? Yeah, I don't have him. Um, when can I activate Kappa, by the way? Can you For the that balance? For me? Yeah. It's like anytime. I would Most love of those actions are anytime actions, but I'll tell you. Faux show. Um, during the spring, you can perform so a right balance now. action according to the usual rules. Okay. Same with like my money guy. He's the same way. All right, so let's start out by getting some food and getting some money. So I'll take food. Three. Actually, I should probably do food twice. Four, five, and I'm out of money though. That's the only other issue. But I get to take some. Some of these things. So I'll take, I'll take this guy. It's worth three points. Five points. Wait, one, two, three, two, four, six, eight. Dang it! I'm just looking if I can accommodate some of these. Lovely. Two, four, six. Did nine. you um, pay your coins for waking them up? Did you have to do that yet? No. Oh, you know what? I didn't. I, I only used Katsune used once, but he doesn't cost any coins. Okay. He's yeah. the one that does yep. it. So just so it's clear. Yeah, I haven't used either of these guys yet. Yeah. So, to wake them up. Yep. But you're right. Good call. Mm -hmm. You do have to pay. It tells you on the side whether or not yeah. it costs. Yeah, Katsuni's free. That's why I knew I didn't have to pay for him. So this is, oh, I can't take this one. I can only take the ones on the right. Mm-hmm. What? All right, I'll take this one. Once you fulfill one. I could, right? Um... No, those are, I, don't, I can't achieve any of those. So I'll do that and I'll score one. Okay. So I'll score, I'll let folks see. I'm going to score, I have these two here. So I will score this guy for three. Okay. So give me three points. Okay. One, two, three, get my points back for not feeding my people. <laughs> All right, so that was it. Those are my... Three actions. I'm not going to use him yet. I'll okay. hold him right now. I'll just put these to work. So, I think I'm screwed on my plants now. Why not? Because I don't have any more plants to buy. Oh. Okay. You're done? Mm hmm Okay. I'm gonna go I guess I'll go down here and do this. First Ugh, and I don't have the actions I need too. You keep buying up all those things. You've got all the buy the stuff. Shoots. Buy the stuff shoot. <laughs> what does that even mean? You know what that means. I don't know what that means. <laughs> you have all the buy the stuff shoots. All right. I'm just going to do this. Let's see what we can do here. Uh -huh. So I'll take three. 
Boom. Okay. And take three of these guys. And I'm going to activate my Kitsune. So these actions can be whatever I want. Mm -hmm. Right? And I will do one, decorate your house. And I'm probably going to do two. Let's see. Let's see what I need here. Um, I do need that guy. Um, I do need one of those guys. I actually need two of those. So let's shop, shall we? Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, so I'll take... Three, six, okay, I'll take this guy for one, and I'll put him here. So that was a dollar, and I get a point. And I also need to clear this out. I need that, um, that lamp. So here's two, and I get two points for this lamp. Hmm. And that'll go there. Oh, those, that actually happens at the end. Oh, yeah. At the end of my... Oh, at the end of the turn. So I, you can refill those then, yeah? Yeah, you can. I was, didn't want it to be not fair for me, mm. but it looks like no plants came out anyway. No, so. it doesn't matter. It doesn't You're not matter. getting any plants. Yeah, somebody over here has like a ton yeah, of plants. plants. Yeah, but they all have so many comfort points associated with them. Well, it's a very comfortable house. I guess so, right? We like our plants. <laughs> All right, I could do one more shop. Um, how much is that one? Yeah, I guess I could do that. Okay, I'll do another two. So here's all my money. Mm -hmm. I get two points, and I'll take this one. Mm-hmm. So that's it. You good? I'm good. Right. I'm good. We'll see. I'll go here. I'll go here. And I'll go there. Okay. I'm good. Mm-hmm. I'll go on green. Mm. So those are three for green. Okay. I think I think I'm okay with those. I might well I'll swap them all to wild because it's free and I can do mm -hmm. it. Um, I'm gonna take two dollars for one of my actions. I'm going to take a it's like, I want to, do I want to shop? That's my question. <laughs> I just had a big shopping round. <laughs> I'm going to take some food, so I'm good for the end of the game. It's like, I don't want to get too caught up in this. I know. So yeah. I'm going to just take from up here. So I'm going to take this one. Okay. And I'm going to take... Maybe some of these are just like... Score whatever you want because mm -hmm. you can score. Like this guy is like have seven baskets seven, worth of well, points. Well, no, yeah, seven comfort points worth of oh that dude that. The lantern, which I don't, yeah. I don't have. I don't really want that. Mm. Um, so it's like I, maybe I'll just score one with my other action, and I'll score. It doesn't matter which one I score. I have a lot here that I can score. So, like, for example, this temple plus anything below it, mm -hmm. as long as it equals four points or greater, which it does, that's three points. Okay. So I'll grab three. One, two, three. And that's it for, for that. So I am ready to move on to other things here. So let's see. One, two, three. All right, so that was three. I didn't put my things out on green. 
So we'll do, we can do, I don't really care about that one. I guess I'll go here, here, and here. Okay, go ahead. here first. So, ooh. I don't know if I want to do that. I don't know if I need all those coins. Hmm. I like kind of need to do this, I think, first. I need to do that first. So blue. There. Um, all right, here we go. So I'll do I'll do this balance first, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm going to first score this one. So I've got you know the two lanterns and then boom boom boom. So that scores mm -hmm. for six. Um, and then I can score one more so I can score like this one for example no I can't score that one. Oh, I put that in the wrong place this needs to go up here like that or no I guess I'll just put it down here I think I meant to put it up there but I didn't that's fine because it's still it scores this one mm -hmm. right so that one scores so that's two so six is nine oops one two Nine. Uh, so that's my first balance action. Mm -hmm. um, and then I can use this as another balance action, mm -hmm. right? And I could take this and put it here. Mm -hmm. And I'm trying to see if I have anything else that would score. This will score me. I'll take that. Okay, and then I can do this. Still no plants. Hmm. What the heck? Um, all right. Is there a? Uh, I guess I'll pay two of these. I'll get two points, and I'll take this. And put that. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And that's it. Okay. So over to me. I'm going to just go. I'll go down here in the red. I don't think it really matters. Um, I don't even think it matters. I could just go up to purple. I only have one incense left, so it doesn't really matter. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna make it wild anyway. Yeah. Uh, here, you didn't put yours. Oh yeah, yeah. Thing. Uh, so it's purple, which means I just throw another one up there. Doesn't matter. And the action I want to take. Yeah, it doesn't really matter because I've only got one bamboo anyway. Yeah, so I'll grab, I'll grab this guy uh, as my, because I'm going to do a, which we actually didn't even fill these in, but we are going to do a, um, a balance action. So mm -hmm. you want to fill those two times? Oh yeah, sorry. Yeah, you can finish any of your turn. I know. No, 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 no. Those, oh, those, I, oh, I grabbed the bottom one. Sorry, I'm thinking about the end of my game. I know, game. you're already like end game <laughs> and we're not even done with your turn yet. Yeah. Um, so I did one of my balance actions was to take a tile. Mm -hmm. My second one is going to be to score a tile. So okay. let's see what I can score here. There's some that I just can't, unfortunately, but flower, uh, plant plus anything else to the right of it equal to four. Got that. That's three points. So I'll score that one. Thing is, folks, and, and one you need to be aware of is at the end of the game, whatever you haven't scored, if it does match, you get half the points rounded up. So yep. you don't have to do it, but I don't want to take that risk. I want to finish. I'm going to use this guy. 
Mm -hmm. And I'm going to finish with two more scorings. Yeah, that's good. So if you look, I can. Sc I just have to have those in my house, which I do, two points, and I need to have a plant next to a uh, religious or temple thing. Yeah, faith one. And that's another one. So that's five more points. I'll score both of these. Okay. Get your five points. Oh, I will. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. I've got this. I'll just push that here, whatever. It doesn't matter. Just grab that. Okay. So my turn's done. Mine's going to be easy. I'm going to pay one to green. Of all these bamboo. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to take a balance action as well. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to score this because I have seven. Three, six, seven. So that's going to be four points. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to score another one like this one maybe. I could score this plants one. So it needs to be total comfort points four. So that's going to be three points, so four, five, six, seven points. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, we're like neck and neck here. I know. And then shove all those. Yep, just anywhere because yeah, we're not getting the back, so. We are done. Done, done. Okay. All right, so we are now doing the temple thing. I won Tanuki. Yes. Very good. I will shall take my tanuki. You won ukami. Mm -hmm. I won roko ruby. Roko ruby. And you win another ukami. Yes, so, we so took many. All. Yes, we did. All of them, right? So uh -huh. um, now we just have to feed one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, three, wow. four, five, yeah. six, seven. I was one, able to two, feed three, them all. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have no food, but I've got so many ukamis. <laughs> yeah. That's so I can just tap two of them and feed my people. Yep. So that is that. That's it. Yeah, so we're going to do some end game scoring here. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, final scoring. So we're just going to follow the book. It'll tell us exactly what to do. There's not much to it. So after the winter phase has ended, you don't really have to worry about sitting everybody back up because the scoring is really simple here. So what we're going to do is we're going to get two points for every different type of uh, spirit. Yes. So I've got one, two, three, four, five. Two, so three, it's 10 points. Four. One, two, I have four. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's the first thing. Second thing, uh, now we have to verify the harmony in mm -hmm. our homes. You add up the six fields on the left, six fields on the right, six rooms, mm -hmm. and then you add up their comfort totals, and they need to be balanced. So let's yes. look at yours first. What do we okay. have? So I have three, six, seven, eight. Three, six, seven. All right. So. Basically, for every point of difference between each side of your home, you lose two points. Boop, boop. All right? So if you look at mine, I've got two, four. Look on the right, two, four. Oh, I am in nice. perfect, perfect harmony. <laughs> My home is in balance. All right? So that's it. Uh, now we check our balanced tiles and see if there's any that haven't been scored yet. Um, I did not achieve that, so I'm not going to score it. Okay. I think I, I did achieve this. Uh, my sandal, I achieved that. Mm -hmm. I didn't achieve my plants, but I did achieve this one. So I have three, six, nine. Excuse me. Well, yeah, actually, it'll be individual, two, right? Two, two and four, two. Six. Two, four, yeah. six. Yep. So you, you split it in half and round yeah. up. So that's six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, and that's literally it. <laughs> you beat me by a point. <laughs> by one point. One point. Yes. All about balance. <laughs> yes, it is. It is the balance. So let's go talk about it. All right. All right. There you have it. This is bamboo. Yes. So uh, let's talk about... Your thoughts? Um, I uh, absolutely loved this, actually. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> so we were, I mean, obviously we were excited to play it. Um, I wasn't sure if it was going to be like a Botoku light experience mm. or if it was just going to feel like it was happening in that universe. And to me, it felt like it was happening in that universe, um, which was cool. So it didn't, it, it's not like... I would necessarily play this over Botoku or I'd play Botoku over this, if that makes sense. Mm -hmm. um, but I think especially because um, same designer, um, same kind of feel, same sort of environment, you you packed a lot of game into um, a small playtime, mm -hmm. right? Like when we started going through the rules and we started learning the game, I was like, this is really neat because you've got a little bit of area control, you've got a little action selection, you've got, you know, the, the kind of very unique tile placement mm -hmm. that isn't just like polyominal, you know, tile right, placement, right, right. which is cool. Uh, so yeah, it's like, it's like little bits and pieces. I feel like I'm having like an aperitif. Right. You know, no, what I mean? no, exactly. And I, I couldn't, I couldn't agree more. I think um, where Batoku is, you know, a bigger, chunkier, let's 
get this out. Let's mm-hmm. pr- you know, buckle down for a long, yeah. <laughs> heavy game um, that has a lot of things going on. Um, this is definitely a much more pared down, refined experience where yeah. yet there's still a lot of tough decisions to make and a, and a really cool puzzle when it comes to uh, your balance goal objectives and managing your house, right? Mm-hmm. Because once you start designing your house, now you're looking for objectives that fit what you've already built. Yes. Like later in the game. Um, the game rounds move very quickly. Mm-hmm. And you could probably slow play it a little bit if you were trying to yeah. you know, only bring in certain colors in mm-hmm. your bamboo so that you only have one or two at most. And then you kind of can spread out your turn. Yeah, but it would take the, the thought that it would require, mm-hmm. I think, as you're looking at like which bamboo do I take? I have to think about what actions am I going to take on those bamboo mm-hmm. as I'm bringing them in. It's it's a lot. So I kind of like the play of just let's get in what I think I need for that next step that you're you're mm-hmm. probably going to take, and um, yeah, and then just like work the best you can with what you have. Right. So I think um, totally agree. I think it's um, so it, it it hits sort of like that sweet spot of of complexity, mm-hmm. but not being but not overstaying. It's welcome, right? Right. Yeah. And as the game is short enough, and I think it, it ended at the right time because mm-hmm. the longer you go, the more sort of bloated the board gets. Yes. Um, and the more you know, incense you're going to get and, and your turns become like very, and, I, and when, a, when a Euro gets sort of at that point where yeah. it's like you've got so much, uh, so many workers, right. so much, you know, so many resources, it kind of, it's like, all right, what am I doing now? It's like, right. but it, it has to stop at a right, at the right point. Well, and I feel too, like you're not, you never feel really pressed. I want to say you never feel pressed for food because obviously mm-hmm. you, you do. But, um, like, you don't, I think going into the game, I expected I'm going to be filling up this whole board. Mm. You're not filling up the whole no. board, really. I mean, maybe theoretically you could, um, but that's a lot of food. <laughs> that's a lot of food to put out as right. well. And like you said, I think it stops at just the right time, mm-hmm. where you still, in those last couple of moves, you have the satisfaction of being like, how many more points can I squeak out of this? Yeah. And you don't feel defeated, and you also don't feel like it's gone to the point where, like, Okay, this game needs to be over. Yeah. I'm ready. It doesn't There's nothing drag. else I can do. It definitely right. doesn't drag. Yeah. So it 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 just mm-hmm. it plays extremely fast, especially for two. And it's it's one of the the first games in a while now that I feel that the two player, even there there's some area control in it, doesn't feel um, challenging with only two. What do you mean by that? In that where you have a two player, and like you can have a two to four player game that has a, a, a huge area control component mm. that with only two people and only two of us fighting over the area control, yeah. it's usually just you versus me. And it, right. like, you've got this this ghost player who's mm-hmm. basically just having their tokens there yeah. changes the strategy and where you're going to go, what you're going to go after. Mm-hmm. Like, do I want to go big after what, yeah. what he's got his things on right. or do I want to go after the one that's empty? Because normally it's just go wherever you want. We just avoid each other. Right, exactly. And in this case, I've got to avoid two people, yeah. which is which forces me to make smarter decisions. But without having to manage an entire AI yeah, for like two not, people. Yeah, so like I really like that too, that you're really you're playing the game on your own board mm-hmm. and you're comparing how well did I do versus how well did you do. And there's some interaction in terms of like grabbing stuff off the board. Right. Um, but you're right. There was enough movement in the things to do because it's not like there's a ton to do. Mm-hmm. There's enough interaction it too. And all you're doing with the area control is just adding a couple of incense sticks. And it, it really does change the way you play. Yeah, no, I, so I agree. Perfect. Yeah, yeah. And mm-hmm. I think that's that's what I want to see out of a yeah. two-player game when it, when it has this area control mm-hmm. component is sort of that that balance, right? This yes. game is all about balance. Yeah. yeah. Um, and it does it very well. So when, when people talk to us about games we've played and we've, we've reviewed, uh, a big question is how does it play with two? And a lot of cases we've seen over the last few games we've put out, mm-hmm. you know, okay, this game didn't really play well with two. We didn't mm-hmm. feel that way, or this game plays really well. And this is in the right. category of, yes, it plays well with two. Yeah. And it immediately bumps it up on our ratings list. Yes. Should we talk about the our rating system? scale? Yeah, and a lot of folks <laughs> I'm have, curious. have been asking yes. about um, our rating system. We don't have scores. No, we don't have scores because I think that really puts a game in in a box. You know, mm-hmm. <laughs> No pun intended. <laughs> um, you know, it... it because what it does is it, it, it labels it as, all right, this game is a six. And, and people in their heads go, oh, six is bad. I'm going to just skip it. It's too linear. It's too linear. And, it, and a game shouldn't go in that category because, you know, everybody has a different um, way they feel about games. And, well, and even us, it's like a game might be a, a six in some circumstances. Mm-hmm. It might be a ten in other circumstances. So it's kind of hard to judge Right. In, in different settings, different right. groups, the games have different values. So the way we look at it is, is, is it something that would stay in our collection. Mm-hmm. 
uh, is it something that would stay sort of in the pride of place in our collection? Yeah. Like on the top, top shelf, right? Mm -hmm. So if you're looking in your cabinet, the top shelf is the best stuff, sort of the middle of the road stuff that stays in your collection yeah. that you, you don't bring out for your best guests, but you bring yeah. it out for somebody who's kind of just... <laughs> Maybe that's how we should organize our things. And then you've got the bottom <laughs> shelf, which is like, you know, these things need to find their way out at some point. Um, because of some of the things in the middle kind of drop down, yeah. things at the bottom of that list need to find their way out, mm -hmm. right? And those are the things you want to sell or trade off. Yeah. So this game for me, I would put it um, just below top shelf. Really? Yeah. Okay, I'm putting some on the top shelf. Your top shelf, yeah, is, oh, which awesome. is surprising because yeah. I'm, if you know me and and what I, you know, how I kind of gauge these sorts of games, mm -hmm. um, I'm. I'm a little picky. Right. I mean, there's not much that, that lives on my top shelf. So, uh, but I like this one a lot, and I'll, I'll tell you really briefly why. Oh, like because it. it's not a. It's a. It plays quickly, mm -hmm. which is great. I think it's accessible. I think it could be brought out for lots of different, you know, groups. It doesn't take up your entire game night. Mm. So that's great. But that being said, you're not just doing one thing. Right. So a lot of those games that kind of fit that niche are like, it's just a card game. It's just a tile placement game. You know, it, it, which right. is which they are great games, too, in their own right. But I really, really appreciated the way that this felt like a scaled down version of a bigger game. Yeah. So you have many different mechanics that you can help teach people, you know, these different mechanics. Or if you're playing with gamers that already know these mechanics, mm. they can sit down and go, wow, this is really satisfying. It's really right. Um, it's crunchy enough for, a, you know an hour play session mm -hmm. without having to be a bear to pull out and explain a bunch of rules and really kind of grasp the strategy. So yeah, um, plus it's gorgeous. It's got cool components and I like the bamboo that grows. In the bamboo, so. that, yeah, I think that track, the bamboo track is really, really cool, and it yeah. really pushes you to almost, it's kind of like its own, like, weird rondellish thing, yes. where you're kind of, like, yeah. moving actions away and then taking them again. So, um, yeah, really cool. Everything about the game is unique in its way, but it's it's not um, overly complex. And it, 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 what's, what I like to see is is sort of a worker, placer, worker placement-ish, and these bamboos are almost like your workers, right? Kind um, of, yeah, exactly. Because you're, you're, you've got six bamboo. Mm -hmm. The whole game, yeah. That's your workers, but you're but you're exchanging them out for different workers, really. Right. Uh, but right. you always have those workers, and what I do like in the worker placement um, games that are different is in that it's not place a worker get resources, mm -hmm. place a worker get resources. When you have enough resources, build item. Right. Right. Like that's and then that's item, the machine, right? and then take item and upgrade it to better version of item yeah. to then score later. Right. Like yes. that's. That's sort of like the recipe, mm -hmm. and this doesn't follow that, and I yeah. and I appreciate that yes. so much because I've seen so many of the place worker get, uh -huh. you know, that whole trope I just went mm -hmm. down. I see so much of that lately, right. and it's just, to me, that's just samey. It's easy. And it's and I don't want to say it's, it's easy. I don't want to say it's lazy design. Mm -hmm. But it is, right? Because it's been played so much. Right, right. Like, if you're going to do that, well, it's very embedded say, in something much yeah, grander. Yeah, it's, um, it's very, again, it's very linear. It's very straightforward. It's very compartmentalized. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do one action and get something. I'm going to yep. do another action and get something. Um, I'm going to do another action and build something, mm -hmm. right? Um, but this is like, you're, you're doing that because you're saying, hey, I'm going to go take this action. But... You're also, in taking the action, thinking about what am I going to get out for next time. Right. Right? You're, set, you're constantly cool. setting yourself up for something yeah. later and not just collecting ingredients to make yeah. an item. Right? Like, and I yeah, think and that's, there's a lot to think about like, as right. you're doing that. So, I, yeah, that's why, for me, it is living on yeah, the top Yeah, so top shelf. shelf. So if you want to do our color scale, this, this, is a, this would be for green me. for you, and this would be really close to green for me. Yeah. So I think it would be like... This color? Yeah, maybe that color green for you. <laughs> for you. <laughs> and I'm like... Almost like a yellow green. And I'm like right up. Like if you had the yeah. two together, it would be like right up. In the <laughs> head, so. that, that's our color scale. But I think it's a... Um, it's it, it's very telling that, you know, we, we really enjoyed this one. Yeah. Um, and that it was a real hit for us uh, yeah, all around. Sure. Uh, very exciting. It's a, it's a small... You can see it's a very small box. Well, that was the thing too. When it came, I was like... Oh, it's smaller than I thought it was yeah, going to be. But it was. But it's a. But it it's actually heavy. had some weight. I'm like, wait a minute, this is kind of heavy because yeah. there's a lot of cardboard in this right, little right. pack. I mean, a lot of cardboard yeah. in this little package. You're going you're to be punching. Mm -hmm. So uh, really cool. And we did, what we didn't even show you. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Is on the other side of the player boards. Yeah, this is cool. Is a an advanced oh, version of too. the game where it actually lays out specific requirements for you to mm -hmm. put down, and they're different. So they're variable. The different player boards. Yeah. Um, and what it does is it forces you to put down specific types of room tiles when you mm -hmm. do your improvements. Yeah. 
And if you don't, you lose points at the end of the game for not. Yeah. So that's another part of the scoring we didn't go through. So this is like the nighttime side of the board. Yes. So you've got daytime and you've got nighttime. So if you want a more advanced version, um, you play that side. And it just adds a little another layer to the scoring. A little bit of complexity. That if you don't achieve it, you're going to lose a few points, right? right. So that, that's another really cool twist to a game um, that already has a lot going for it. So yeah. again, this is a small box game. Mm -hmm. It sits in a pretty nice little footprint, yeah. so you don't need this sprawling table. Right. It fits right in the center of our table, so we were able to get some really good zoom in shots yeah. um, and, and, and retain clarity here. So um, like we said, there's a lot for this game that uh, comes in this little box. It, it plays well at two players. There's a lot of chunky good decisions. It's a really cool um, tile placement yeah. strategy. And just a neat tactile experience too. Neat tactile. So it hits it hits a lot of things on the head. So bamboo um, is is definitely in the category of another hit from Devere. From Devere, yeah. like they're just killing it lately. Yeah. Um, they've put out so many good games, and, mm -hmm. and it's just you know it, it, it's cool to see another game in the Botoku universe. Can't wait to see Silk. Yes. When that one yeah. comes out as well, because I think you know that'll mm -hmm. kind of like round out this whole this whole collection. So uh, yeah, they've they've been really on fire lately, yeah. and uh, it's great to see that. So it's good quality good quality euros coming out. Awesome. All right. So there you have it. If you like this video and you appreciate what we do and you want to support us and you want to kind of hang out with us behind the scenes, join us over on Patreon. Ant Lab Games. Mm -hmm. The link is down below. Join our Discord server. We have you know you can just join it. Yeah. just to join it and, and join in on all the, the board gaming discussions that we have over there. Um, and that's really it. Yeah. Let us know what you thought. If this is something that you think you'll be getting your hands on um, or you have other comments about our experience, please leave them in the comments below. And, um, you know, ask us any questions you want, as always. And uh, I think that's, that's it. All right. So thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed the video. We'll see you next time. We'll see ya.